The world of television is filled with secrets that the viewing public would often kill to know. This is why fans are so excited when they find that rare celebrity that's willing to spill a secret or two. And that's part of the unique appeal of Kaylee Cuoco. In addition to playing the beautiful girl next door on TV's The Big Bang Theory, Cuoco has developed something of a reputation as someone who's not afraid to speak her mind. On topics ranging from her divorce to the future of her breakout television show to feminism itself, Cuoco has never been afraid to call it like she sees it, even if no one else agrees. Here are a few of the top times that Kaylee Cuoco decided to air her dirty laundry. Big Bang Bye Bye? Big Bang Theory has gone on for 10 seasons, with its best days arguably behind it. And some wonder if it will ever end, including the self-proclaimed queen of the nerds. Yeah, 10 years? Come on! It's All like my 20s! I went from, like, hot to, like, 30. <laughs> <laughs> it's like... I was 21 when I started the show. Cuoco has publicly hinted that in order for her to return for an 11th season, it'd be expensive, which all but confirms the rumors that she wants a giant salary increase before returning to those apartment sets again. Ink and a Miss Many people were understandably surprised when Cuoco married tennis player Ryan Sweeting after just a few months of dating, but they were even more surprised when they suddenly split. During their brief marriage, Cuoco constantly combated rumors that they were unhappy, but they ultimately divorced after being wed only 21 months. Cuoco ended up spilling the deets of the couple's demise for everyone to hear, because that's what she does. Yes, I'm getting divorced. You know. Last year was very bizarre, and um, we all go through really weird ups and downs, and sometimes you're, I'm a little bit more seen, and everyone goes through that stuff, you know? Yep. So I already feel like 2016 is going to be a much better year than 2015, and, um, you know, I, it's just been, it's been rough, but I, things are going good, and I'm much, much better now. I'm in a much better place than I was. To top off the heartbreak, Cuoco had made the unfortunate decision to get a commemorative tattoo when she and Sweeting first got married, featuring Roman numerals to match the date that they were hitched. Fortunately, she had an equally subtle way of covering the date up after the divorce. She had a giant moth tattooed over it. The Moneymakers Since the very beginning of Big Bang Theory, the show has never failed to capitalize on Cuoco's breasts as part of her sex appeal to all her geeky pals. That's young Kaylee right there. Yeah, that's, that's many, many moons ago. I mean, wow. look how high my boobs are. Some fans have wondered if Cuoco had a little extra help physically blossoming in between starring on Eight Simple Rules and Big Bang Theory, given the apparent increase in size. For her part, Cuoco didn't let the mystery go on for long. Not only did she admit to having had an augmentation in a women's health interview, but she fiercely defended the decision as the best thing she ever did. Not because it increased her attractiveness to men, but because it made her feel confident and amazing. That's not the only trip under the knife she admitted to either. She also came clean about having had neck filler and a nose job, too. Tissue Issue Hollywood addictions are unfortunately too common, but Cuoco's was something lots of sinus sufferers have dealt with – nasal spray. Yep, Cuoco copped to having her own over-the-counter obsession of the saline variety, which took her years and some surgical intervention to kick. I was actually really addicted to nose spray, like Afrin. After or before? Before. Like, for years. Like, at award shows, I would have to pick out the right clutch to be able to fit my Afrin in it. And I'd be under the table like... TMI is clearly a four-letter word for Kaylee Cuoco. Chronic Googler Another habit that Cuoco shares with some of her fans is being absolutely obsessed with social media. Specifically, she is absolutely obsessed with what other people say about her on social media. She told Cosmopolitan that she realizes it's a textbook case of not being able to please everyone, especially her haters. But it doesn't stop her from continuing to click. Quote, I'll read something from someone in Indiana who's like, she looked disgusting in that dress, and it's going to ruin my night. I started reading and thought, maybe I need to make more of an effort and not go out in my Uggs and be disgusting. So I started putting on makeup. And they started writing, wow, someone really likes being in front of the camera. And her hair's done now for coffee. I couldn't do anything right. Why am I reading this But I'm obsessed. I openly admit to being totally insane about that." End quote. Feminism flip-flop 
Kaylee Cuoco made an entire ocean's worth of waves when she was interviewed for Red Book in 2014 because she said that she was not a feminist, saying, quote, I was never that feminist girl demanding equality, but maybe that's because I've never really faced inequality, end quote. Her statement received criticism from pretty much every corner of the globe, with many expressing confusion and consternation that someone who acknowledges that she actively benefits from that fight for equality would not consider herself as an advocate for equality. Cuoco eventually walked back back on her statement when she told Cosmo, quote, "...of course I'm a f***ing feminist. Look at me. I bleed feminism. I get equal pay to my male co-stars on a big show. I have my own home. I am as independent as you could possibly be." End quote. Despite her statement switcheroo, something tells us Gloria Steinem won't be inviting her over for tea anytime soon. A leak to stop the flood. Kaylee Cuoco was said to be part of the 2015 hack that exposed the private photos of so many celebs. But instead of letting someone else show off her intimate pics, she fought fire with fire and released her own nude photo. Well, sort of. She posted an image to Instagram of herself and then-husband Ryan Sweeting frolicking on the beaches of Mexico. But the catch was that she blurred out the naughty bits, including her breasts and her husband's crotch, and playfully wrote that despite the fun, it felt like we forgot something. She later bore her bosom on Snapchat, with a few cleverly positioned stickers to remain PG, but it was a cheekier-than-usual move from a star that has never shied away from speaking her mind and being proud of her body, showcasing the same impressive sense of humor that, presumably, keeps the Big Bang laugh track from driving her insane. Thanks for watching. Click the Nikki Swift icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love, too!